everyone! Um, today I'm going to show you how to successfully install a texture pack. So, first of all, you're going to want to open up a new browser and go to the first link in the description. Uh, that will take you to a texture pack. So, I'm going to go to www.bdcraft.net, is it? .net or .com, one of which. Um, but this can work for any text pack. I'm mainly showing you how to install it because it can get quite confusing. This is for Windows 7, Windows XP, and Windows Vista. Maybe a tiny bit different, and Mac will be quite a lot different. Um, so first of all, tr try and find the download. So I'm just going to try and do that now. Get it? Uh, that's probably it. Sorry, my internet's a tiny bit slow because I am. Um, well, I don't. I shouldn't say a tiny bit, but at the moment I am rendering a video, so <laughs> yeah. Anyway, oh, here we go. Right. So, uh, depending what level of computer can, com whatever it is, it can take. Uh, it's a 128 bit, and that one I'm going to install. Uh, the 128 bit. Um, I've already got this texture pack, but it'll let you reinstall it. So usually it'll take you to AdFly or Media Fire, Medial Fire. Now there might be a few problems with Media File, Fire, whatever it's called, but <laughs> um, AdFly, AdFly. Uh, just take concentrate on this up here. You, you see this? Your download will be ready and blah blah blah, and it comes up with all this crap. It's bollocks. Just ignore it. <clears throat> you click on it, you'll probably get virus or whatever. Just ignore it, it's just trying to trick you and scam you. So just concentrate on the blue bar at the top, just ignore any of this, you know, any signs saying, you know, click here, you're the millionth user, it's all just lies. And even if it was, what good what is it what good is it to you? So, um just in, just ignore all this and concentrate on the blue bar up here. And when when the time is stopped, it will say skip ad. Uh this download will start as soon as possible. Um so then it should come up down here. <coughs> here we go. So you just want to go on and click first of all save. Okay, this looks like it's going to take a bit of time. But um while that's downloading down here, I'll just show you this. So basically, if you're running on 16 by 16 bit um Java I'd recommend using either of these. Uh, if you're running on 32-bit, run either of these. 64-bit, run either of these. 65, th 128, that one, and then, you know, whatever version your um, Java is. But I'm running 32-bit Java, and then I'll prove that just now if I type in Java. Java, oh no, it doesn't come up with a 32-bit on the end, but it is 32-bit. Um, and I can run 256 bit fine, it just won't run uh, 512 bit because that's a bit over the top for um, a 32 bit Java. Um, but yeah, everything's going to look pretty good uh, when the next uh, update comes out. But just still waiting on this to download. As I say, I am rendering a video right now. So yeah, this is going to be awkward. You can, yeah, that's probably what 512 bit looks like, as you can see, like Ultra HD, um, with the pickaxe and everything. Uh, you can get it for Pocket Edition, which is uh, pretty darn cool. Um, but you'd have to install that on the computer and then onto the uh, 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 like whatever you you're trying to run it on, it, um, like Android or iOS. Um, so yeah, as you can see, no jailbreak required, which is pretty darn cool. Because once you jailbreak, you're open to viruses and all that. And um, if you get virus and you hand it back to uh, Apple Store, they'll say nope because you're jailbroken. <laughs> so yeah, runs on all these different platforms. So this is going to be a very awkward wait. My recent Amazon. Yeah, I'm gonna get a microphone windshield because uh, I don't know if you can hear right now, but um, I'm breathing very loudly. Because <laughs> I've already got one of them shields that go in front of the mic, but I just can't set it up properly because um, 
the room on the desk here is just um, quite quite a tight space. I've got nowhere really to put it, so. But one of them can just slip right over this and it'll pretty much be like no difference. Do you want to change the colour scheme to improve performance? Has detected a uh, current colour scheme and don't show me this message again. There we go. <laughs> I know it's running slow, uh, it's because, um. Uh, obviously I'm recording and also <laughs> I'm recording here and also I am uh, uploading a video as you probably already know exit part 29 watch it <laughs> watch it now oh almost done 17 5 uh, so you want to go to open folder um, if, it, if it only has the option of open I'll show you what to do so if you go to open folder, but if you can only open the open file, then you click up here and then you highlight all of that until you get to the backslash, press back and then enter. And now if you open the folder, if it, you did have the option, it should automatically look like this, but that's what you do to get there. Um, you get the Sfax Pure BD Craft, or whatever you've called it, should be, um, should be uh, the one highlighted if it's not just scroll down and look for it then you want to run your minecraft as you usually would uh, there we go so this will run all over mods and everything optifine <laughs> uh, right here we go I shall be trying to um, download single player commands mod so um, I can like try and make maybe like a mini Minecraft movie or something. But anyway, once you run, uh, once you run Minecraft, you want to get your file back. Oh nope, that's the wrong file. This is a file. Uh, right, so then you go to the options in Minecraft, resource pack, then open resource pack folder. This will probably be empty if um, this is your first time installing a texture pack. Then you get this folder that should just open up. Oh, okay, for some reason it closed down. <laughs> but uh, you should have this one and this one. This, which is highlighted, you just want to drag straight over to here. So just like this. And obviously, I've already got a folder in there called that because uh, I've already downloaded it like a both. <laughs> and then that'll just say in your downloads. I'd leave it in your downloads. There's no really point deleting it unless you want to, like, really memory hoard and like keep your hard drive completely clean um uh but yeah then you can go to your new texture pack which is this one <laughs> and then you can wait a little while if your computer is slow like mine <laughs> and then you can go back go on single player and then enjoy the epicness of the texture pack Border, 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 do, 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 do. Yeah. Anyway, so if this helped, uh, leave a like. If you would like to see more tutorials, subscribe. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.